Hi, Gemini. Welcome back. This is going to be a timeless love reading. Whenever you feel drawn to the title, to the picture, that's when it's meant for you. Always take what resonates and then at any time you would like me to focus in on just your energy, click on the link below. It's in the description box of every reading and it'll take you right over to my Etsy shop. You can check out the multiple readings that I offer over there. I am giving away three free love readings for the month of February. So all I need you to do is be a subscriber and I'm grateful you are here. New and returning subscribers leave a heart emoji in the comment section of each reading that you view of mine during the month of February. I'll be reaching out to three people that I randomly choose at the end of the month through YouTube initially. So make sure your notifications are on and that you check back around that time. Um, and then I'll send you the link to, to go right over to my Etsy shop where it's secure and I'll get your information and send you the reading through there. All right, let's see what's coming through for my Geminis. Flirt, extend your lighthearted energy to others. Hmm. Sometimes when you're in a connection, you kind of lose that flirt, you know, and it's, it's, it's fun to have. It's important to have. It keeps it interesting. It keeps like a magnetic connection. Like sometimes life just takes over and you forget that, that fun. And look at this, birth, card of four, universal energy brings you opportunity and possibilities at the bottom of the deck lovers there are two paths ahead be true to yourself let's see what's coming your way Gemini lovers is your card is your energy for my Gemini spirit All right there we go they kept wanting to come out and then fly back in. Here's the other one. Passion, a magnetic and seductive quality surrounds you at present. I say mag magnetic and it comes right out. All right, let's see what's coming towards you, Gemini. I feel like I messed these up. Oh, here we go. Spirit, Gemini's energy. Gemini's energy. We got the lovers again. And the Ten of Wands. So I feel like you feel a connection towards somebody already. It's almost like there's a burden involved. A burden to be together. Obstacles in your way to be with this person. And it's hard to like miss, but it's almost like the same resembling energy. All right, let's see. What is the energy coming towards Gemini? Ace of Wands, fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, a breakthrough, passionate breakthrough. What is the past energy? Page of Wands. This might be a younger fire sign. Younger, fi younger fire sign who is very free spirited. You know, Page of Wands is like that feisty, passionate communication. But may not be looking to be settled down. What is the, the present energy spirit? For Gemini, present energy in love, feeling stuck, feeling a lack of feeling, a lack of emotionally content, needing to make a decision. What does the future hold for Gemini and this person? The world. I feel like somebody's ready to confess how they feel about you. Have a brand new beginning with you. 
like suffering in silence, but about to come, you know, about to come towards you. Please clarify the uh, the energy of Gemini's person. Yeah, definitely could be a Leo that has love for you, Gemini. In their head about you. I feel like you're definitely going to receive communication. Please clarify the page of wands. Now they're leveling up. Now they're ready for this. They're coming in very, um, very, they're, you find them very sexy. You find them, you have this like magnetic draw feeling towards them. They're coming in very confident. They've manifested this with you. Yeah, they cannot get you out of their mind. And what is the overall outcome? Both of you being very honest with yourself, with your, with each other, overcoming these unhealthy boundaries, like these unhealthy patterns. You definitely only have eyes for one another and you want to be in this union. But I got to say, I really feel like you're going to be a little bit hard on them. They had you feeling stuck. They had you in like your head, in your head about this. And I feel like you're really going to let them have it. I feel like you definitely want a new beginning with them, but you're just not going to be very quick to let them off the hook. Yeah, see, they might have ghosted you. Gave you no explanation of why they were leaving. You definitely felt heartbreak from this. And you found yourself set at crossroads. But I do feel like you worked on yourself, Gemini. Like I said, I don't feel like you're going to be too quick to put your sword down. It's like actions speak louder than words. For some of you, there's a physical distance between each other. But a light bulb is definitely going off in their head. Fire energy here. We have your energy, Gemini. We have Leo. Water energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Aquarius. Libra. But it's like they're traveling the distance. Ace of Wands and Ace of Cups. That is what they feel for you. There is about to be a brand new beginning. I love it. Six of coins and the six of cups. That comforting connection returning to your life. You definitely made an impact on them. For Gemini and their person spirit. Gemini and their person. Additional clarity. All right, we have a card of timing. The chariot within one to three months during the summer, June 22nd to July 21st. Now, from the time that you view this, one to three months out, I feel like it's going to be through the internet, direct message, maybe email, but I also feel like you're keeping an eye on one another. Anything else? Yeah. Feeling like your wishes are finally coming true. You thought about this. You thought about how this would feel. Alright, we'll take them all. 
like I said, it's not going to resonate for each and every one of you, but we will make it as personal as possible, larger than life, getting more information. Finding out what happened between the two of you, why it went down the way it did. Um, finding out what went on, you know, why you were in separation, like the revelation, the hanged man energy where the light bulb goes off. But there's definitely good fortune and it's shifting in this energy. Again, feeling like your wishes are coming true. See, fall full moon. One to three months. That's not fall though. So for some of you, it might not be until the fall. But there's happiness here. Good omen. Releasing old baggage. Being ready to commit. And look what's at the bottom of the deck. Happy, harmony, reconciliation. This person views you as a gift in their life. Gemini. Message from Gemini's person. Okay. You are the reason I smile every day. I feel like they are watching you through social media. Just to feel connected to you. Looking at pictures. Broken promises. For some of you, I really feel like you felt ghosted. You felt left without any explanation. You've helped me feel things I never thought I could. All right. Final message, Spirit. Okay. We'll take, we'll take three. I have to guard my heart so that I don't get hurt again. I look you up online. Exactly. To see what you've been doing. I am trusting the divine time while we both learn and heal. Alright guys. Bottom of the deck, it's always been you. Gemini. We have L. T as in Tabitha. G for George. U. N for Nancy, O, R, D for Donia, Donna, W, E, A, C, F as in final, M, Mary, Melissa, um, I, so we have every vowel, K, Katrina, Catherine, Katie, Kyle, and we have all the rest, N, T, R, yeah, okay, so focus on the messages I just delivered and what actually came out. I wish you the best of luck in this connection, but for some of you, there is definitely a reconciliation on the horizon. Love and light. 